So earlier this week, I talked to Bryson and Makai about not being able to bail out a Tavion. The ability to be bailed out is what he lost. He cannot get bailed out of prison because he do way too much stuff wrong now. However, when Kai just called me and asked to bail you out, which is what we're trying to prevent once he gets older, realizing that you know you would get in trouble, but yet you keep letting him coerce and talk you into asking. One, if he didn't tell you to do it, you're in trouble because you should already know he can't be bailed out no more. We talked about that. Two, you talked him into it because he would be minding his business. Did he talk you into it? Because he would be minding his damn bit. What? You open your mouth. I told him not to bail me. Like, he was saying because he wanted me to get him on Madden, and I was telling him to not bail me out. And he was telling me stuff that Bryce was doing, and I was like, oh, okay. And then he kept trying to bail me out so I could get him stuff on Madden. I told him not to bail me out. This time? Yes, sir. Like, when he called you? That's why he kept stuttering. I was telling him to like stop telling him that and stop trying to bail me out. That's why he kept stuttering. Hey, Kai. Listen, let me, let me just tell you what the problem is. This and it is your fault. It's completely your fault. You cannot teach somebody how to sell drugs and then tell them once they become the best drug dealer in the kingpin, hey, man, what I told you was wrong. You should stop it. Cause that's what you did. Now, are you about to tell me a story or about to tell me the truth? Know that if I find out that you're telling me a story, you're gonna lose your phone, period. So if I were you, I would rethink what you're about to say. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Do you wanna lose your phone? Yes, Do you wanna not be able to get on your mat and get on the computer? Huh? On your game. Or do you want to be able to get on your game? Yes, sir. So therefore, whatever you say better be the truth and everything. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Did he tell you to bail him out? No, sir. So stop. You answer my questions only. I don't ask, you don't answer. Did he tell you to help him get his phone back? Yes, sir. When? Just now. Can you make it a little super face? Okay, well sit your back up right. Back up. Sit up. Sit up. You're a man. Don't slouch. And what you say? So what happened to you just now when you called me? Was it him or you? Besides calling me, did he tell you to call me? Make sure you're honest. Because being honest is the only thing that's keeping your phone right now. What you losing for today. So all this time, as I told you, you can't get no bail out. You just talking to him while we going to practice about bailing him out, getting bailed out. Did you, did you say that? Yes, sir. And, and he told me, that's why, that's why he called when he called because he didn't feel it. That's why he didn't be sneaking. Yeah, he, he just said that when we was dishing out right there when he called you and I was telling him not to call you and he was started whispering because the camera was right there and then he called you. And then at practice, he walked up to me and said, I'm going to have a good practice today so I can bail you out because I want you to give me on Madden. And I didn't say nothing back. Okay, you better be careful. Did you say it? No, sir. God, yes, you did. Oh, now. And then the, when we hold went on, to so the now it's a problem. When you taught them to lie, it's a problem that when they're not telling the truth for you. See how that shit work? Yes, 
person? No, you don't. So you did. Yo, I asked for no better. And you'll fix yourself. I'm gonna have to punish you from then from now on to be a better person. So no, you don't. Yeah. You're about to lose everything. Can't use it today. You're about to be not able to use it tomorrow. I'm just trying to maintain it. You will never go to practice with us again. From now on, I'm about to tell you not to be around us. I'm about to tell you not to be around us. I'm contemplating it in my head that you shouldn't be around us. You are a problem. You are a problem and you are our problem. You're becoming a problem. You're becoming somebody I do not like. And I don't like you. Any reservations I have towards taking something from you will be gone. You're the problem, but you don't even see it. I, I do see that I'm the problem. Like the whole week, he was trying to get me to get to mad and stuff, and I've been telling him no the whole week because I've been trying to get out of trouble. No, you're not getting out of trouble within a week no more. You're not getting out of trouble within a month. This is permanent the way you're living. Permanent. You're about to have a baby, and you're afraid of you better. You're starting to take form of somebody I do not like. And I'm not okay with that. That's why you're losing your phone as well. And you're about to lose Maddie. And I'll get on the phone for you from now on every day. But you, my thing is, I, that's actually what I told you to do anyway. I told you that you got to go through your homework stuff. Then get on the phone. Did you do that today? Mm -hmm. But you're touching the phone. This is a punishment. Get the um, the phone. And you got the phone. Read for your 20 minutes. And you're going to go back and forth. You're going to read for 20 minutes. And do math for 20 minutes. You don't even have to read for 20 minutes. You don't have to do math for 20 minutes. So what y'all gonna do? You want to do both for an hour. Yeah, two hours. And do both for two hours. I don't care which one you jump back and forth between. I don't care which one when you take your break. I want you doing them both for two hours. Do you hear me? Mm -hmm. That's the only way that one, you're gonna be using your phone right now. But for the rest of the day, you can't get all those games. You can't use your phone. After today, catch you in any more situation where you're lying or being sneaky. You're taking your phone. Any situation where you're dealing with him and you mention getting anything back from him, I'm taking your phone. Anything about him getting on the game. I'm taking your phone. Thank you. You're used to get, use your phone and you play the game every single day. 